processor, SOC. Let's start with the star of the show, the processor, also called the system on chip. This tiny square of silicon is the brain of the smartphone, but it's more than just a brain. It combines a CPU for logic and apps, a GPU for graphics, an NPU for artificial intelligence, an ISP for photos and video, and even a modem for mobile data. Imagine squeezing an entire computer, a gaming console, and a camera processor into something smaller than your fingernail. That's what an SOC does. It's incredibly fast and efficient, but push it too hard with heavy gaming or video editing, and you'll feel the heat, literally. Still, without it, the smartphone is nothing more than a paperweight, RAM. Now, brains need memory. That's where RAM comes in, the short-term memory of your phone. It holds all the apps and tasks you're juggling at once. Switch between your game, your messages, and your music. And RAM makes it instant. The more RAM, the smoother the experience. But once it fills up, things start to stutter. RAM is powerful but temporary. Turn off the phone, and it all vanishes. Storage. Permanent memory lives here. Your storage is the digital filing cabinet where every photo, video, song, and app is kept. Modern phones use UFS storage, which reads and writes at lightning speeds. That's why apps launch quickly, and why recording Fortnite's video doesn't choke the system. But space runs out fast, especially with games and videos getting heavier. It's reliable, but once it's full, the experience slows down. Battery. Every spark of life in your smartphone comes from the battery. Shaped to fit the slim body, lithium-ion batteries pack massive energy in a small frame. They power everything from the processor to the vibration motor. Fast charging gets you hours of power in minutes, and wireless charging means you just drop it on a pad and go. But batteries age. They lose capacity over time, and extreme heat makes it worse. For now though, they remain the beating heart of every smartphone. Display. This is where the magic meets your eyes. AMOLED and OLED screens light up millions of pixels to paint vibrant colors and smooth animations. Some refresh 120 times per second, making scrolling feel buttery. Foldable screens even bend like paper. The downside? They're fragile and power-hungry. Still, the display is where we live, watching movies, playing games, and scrolling endlessly through feeds. Touchscreen layer. Under the glass is the touchscreen digitizer. It senses the exact point your fingers tap or swipe, translating gestures into actions. It's the invisible bridge between you and the software. Multi-touch lets you zoom with two fingers, while newer layers respond instantly with ultra-low latency. But scratches or cracks can make it less accurate. Without it, your phone becomes a screen you can only look at, not interact with. Cameras, smartphone cameras are tiny engineering marvels. A sensor captures light through precision lenses, while the image processor turns raw data into sharp photos. Multiple lenses give you wide shots, zoom shots, macro details, even cinematic depth. Software adds HDR, night mode, and AI enhancements. The strength, portability, and versatility. You can shoot professional-looking photos in second. The weakness? Physics. Tiny sensors can't match big professional cameras in low light. Still, most of us can't tell the difference anymore. Speakers? For a device this small, smartphone speakers are surprisingly powerful. They deliver calls, music, and notifications, often in stereo with top and bottom drivers. Some even tune sound with Dolby Atmos for a cinematic feel. But physics again plays a role. The sound is thin compared to full speakers. Still, for watching YouTube or listening on the go, they're incredibly capable. Microphones? Microphones give smartphones a voice. From phone calls to voice messages and video recording, they capture sound with stunning clarity. Multiple microphones cancel background noise, so your voice cuts through even in a busy street. They're sensitive enough to hear whispers, but can distort with loud concerts. Yet, they're essential for everything, from voice assistance to video calls. Vibration motor. That buzz in your pocket? It comes from a small vibration motor tucked inside the phone. Eccentric rotating motors, linear resonant actuators, and haptic engines all bring tactile feedback to life. A subtle tap when typing. A gentle buzz for a notification. It's how the phone communicates silently. They're precise but limited. You won't feel a wide range of textures yet. Still, they're vital for that connected feeling. Sensors, smartphones are packed with hidden senses. 
The accelerometer tracks movement, so it knows when you flip the phone. The gyroscope detects rotation, helping with gaming and AR. The magnetometer points north for your compass. Proximity sensors shut off the screen near your ear. Ambient light sensors adjust brightness automatically. Barometers detect altitude, and fingerprint or face sensors keep your data secure. Each one is tiny, but together, they make your phone aware of you and its surroundings. Motherboard, all roads lead here. The motherboard is the central circuit board connecting every component, processor, storage, battery, antennas. It's layered with microscopic traces carrying power and data at lightning speed. Compact and dense, it's the unsung hero that makes everything work in harmony. The only struggle? Repairs. Motherboards are so integrated that fixing one part often means replacing the whole board. Power management IC, the phone doesn't just need power, it needs clean, controlled power. That's what the power management chip does. It takes raw energy from the battery and delivers it in precise amounts to the processor, screen, and radios. It prevents overheating and overcharging, keeping the device stable. Without it, the phone would fry itself the moment you turned it on. Antennas. Hidden in the frame are the antennas, the lifelines to the outside world. They capture cellular signals, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and GPS. Multiple antennas ensure strong reception, and some even handle ultra-fast 5G. But they're delicate, cover the wrong spot, and signals can weaken. Still, they're the invisible threads that tie your smartphone to the rest of the planet. SIM tray and eSIM. The SIM tray holds your SIM card, the tiny chip that tells networks who you are. Some phones now use eSIM, which is built in and programmable. Physical SIMs are easy to swap. eSIMs save space and allow multiple profiles. Both are critical. Without them, your phone is just a fancy camera with no identity on the network. Ports, at the bottom, you'll find the charging and data port. USB-C dominates, offering fast charging, data transfer, and even video output. Some phones still carry headphone jacks, a beloved classic. Others have IR blasters for remote control. These small ports are simple in appearance, but vital for connectivity. Their weakness? They wear out after years of use. Wireless charging coil. Invisible, but futuristic. The wireless charging coil lets your phone recharge without plugging in. Place it on a pad, and power flows through electromagnetic induction. It's convenient and getting faster each year. The catch? It's less efficient than wired charging and generates more heat. Still, it feels like magic every time you set it down. External body. Finally, the body. Glass, metal, or plastic. It holds everything together. Gorilla glass resists scratches. Aluminum frames add strength. And plastic keeps costs low. Some phones even use ceramic for luxury. The body is more than protection. It affects antennas, cooling, and weight. It's where design meets function. The reason phones feel premium or cheap in your hand. And there you have it. The orchestra of hardware inside your smartphone. Each piece, from the silent sensors to the loudspeakers, plays its part to deliver the seamless experience we take for granted every day. Next time you tap, swipe, or snap a photo, you'll know there's an entire hidden world working underneath. But here's the kicker. This is just the hardware. The software that drives it all is another universe of secrets, optimizations, and innovations. Curious to explore that side of the story? Subscribe, leave your questions, and stay tuned. Because the deeper we go, the more fascinating it gets.